thought the I could use some help over here. You seem perturbed, my friend. Has your work with Chief Oberlin been that taxing? Don't you be starting to change things up around here. We got a system, and it works, damn it. How crude. Come now, my friend. What is this all about? Of course his men work for me. You all work for me, my friend. Allow me to explain. James T. Oberlin is a workhorse. Powerful, focused, efficient. But someone like him needs order. Blinders and a carrot, if you will. With too much freedom or thought, people like him are lost. James came to me as a part of a package. I bought a box of cereal, and he was the delightful toy at the bottom. Attention. Now he was a highly decorated, highly skilled prize, but still a part of a larger whole. The best thing for someone like him is a simple purpose. He plays this role because he needs to believe it's true. A smarter man would see through this facade immediately. But not Oberlin. Oh, no. A crueler thing would be shattering the only thing that's kept the man sane for the past two decades. I do this for him, you know. Ah, you're no stranger to the game, I see. But you must know you're playing against an experienced player, no? If you understand my meaning. Very well. You've caught me red-handed. I hope this pedals will stay your hand. I could use some help over here. I miss research and science and discoveries and news. Supplies are starting to dwindle. I miss how it was before. Even with the stockpile from the supply run. I miss research and science. I'll have to keep an eye on Audrey. I think the stress of everything is getting to her. You're back. And without Daniel. What was the situation? You're serious? And you have proof? Are you sure? Look at me. Are. You. Sure? Damn it all to hell. Daniel. The rest of them. Leading me on like some child playing make-believe. And Stoltz. That arrogant, slimy bastard. I knew I couldn't trust him. I should have followed my gut from the start. And nobody wants to know. I'm gonna kill that. You know, no. Not yet. Not now. I can't give him the opportunity to turn this around on me. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. I need time to make sense of this. It's best that Hugo remain unaware that I've been shown the truth. Not until I'm ready to act. I will allow him to think he retains control. You've earned a reward for your effort, and honesty. I will let you know if and when I decide to act on this revelation. For now, I wait. Be careful with who you place your trust in down here. It's a viper's den. Dismissed. Keep an eye on Audrey. The stress of everything is getting to her. 